What's up, YouTube? Back with your boy Luke and back to the College of Hooker Knowledge. Guys, I got to tell you, I saw a scam a couple weeks ago. I've been meaning to make a video about it. It is absolutely scandalous. It's slimy. It's not legit at all, but it is absolutely brilliant. I saw one of these Tijuana hookers from one of the big bars pull an unbelievable scam on some customers. Probably some of you guys that are watching this video right now have fallen for this scam. And I got to put it out there. It's absolutely unbelievable story. Let's jump right into it. All right, guys, check this out. I'm down in Ensenada, Mexico. I'm down in the Valle de Guadalupe about three weeks ago, hanging out with this girl. And it came time for me to come back to North Dakota and go back to work in the oil patch. And as I'm packing my bags and getting ready to go, I'm going to take her back to the bar where she works, right? Well, as I get ready to go, she tells me, hey, by the way, I want you to take me to the airport. Don't take me to the bar. I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. And then she's like, no, no, no. Actually, take me to the bar, but then take me to the airport. I'm going to the Tijuana airport. And I go, cool. So we get in the car. We're hauling ass down the road. Swing by Zona Norte. She comes out with a suitcase and a neck pillow, right? And I'm not really thinking anything of it. Seems legit to me. So on the way to Otay Mesa, on the way to the airport, I ask her. I said, hey, where are you going? She looks at me and she says, no damn where. I said, what do you mean? And she starts smiling and giggling and she's texting on her phone. I'm like, what's going on? She's like, I got a customer that I'm meeting at the airport because he flew me to Tijuana, supuestamente. He bought me an airline ticket and he's going to spend the weekend with me. I'm like, what are you talking about? And she was like, he called me, he said he wanted to see me. Guys, this scandalous bitch told this dude that she was in the interior of Mexico. He sent her $150 or $200 for a plane ticket that doesn't even exist, okay? Now, her plane's supposed to fly in at like 7 o'clock. Here it is like 3, 30, 4 o'clock. I'm dropping her off at the airport. She's got a fake bag packed, a damn neck pillow as if she's been on a plane, okay? And she's texting him. He's under the impression that she doesn't work anymore. She's been throwing ass. She's been slinging ass in Tijuana all week. Then she went and she hung out with me down in the Valle de Guadalupe, okay? Then she's going back to the Tijuana airport where she's going to fake that she's been on an airplane where he's going to pick her up after sending her a Western Union for the ticket. Then he's going to pay her in cash to be with her. Gets even better. Later on, he's going to take her back to the airport and drop her off, okay, in a couple days because she's flying back to the interior of Mexico. And that's all bullshit, guys. She's turning around. She's walking out the back door, getting in a cab, and going back to the club. Now, she did say she wouldn't work the rest of the day because she's a little bit nervous that maybe he went back to the club also, right? And she doesn't want to get caught. So, don't be buying plane tickets from these whores. It's bullshit. They're telling you they're in the interior of Mexico. They're not. Just because you picked them up at the airport, unless you see her big ass get off of the airplane, it could be bullshit. Now, she tells me going into this deal too, that she does this to two or three guys routinely. She makes two to three fake trips to the airport every two or three months. They think they've paid for her plane ticket to Tijuana when the whole time she's in Tijuana slinging ass. Unbelievable, right? They think they're paying for the plane ticket for her to go back. She's not going back. She's walking down a couple terminals and out the door and taking a cab right back to Zona Norte. So, guys, don't trust these girls. I made a video. I told you these whores are not the Girl Scouts, okay? They're absolutely scandalous. Anyways, guys, I just wanted to share that video with you. I've got a lot of good videos coming up. I was in Monterey, Mexico about six weeks ago. I did do some footage there. I've got a couple videos that I just don't like, guys, and I'm not going to post stuff if I don't like it. If I make the video and I don't like it or I don't think it's got good information, I shit can the video, okay? Smash that like and subscribe button if you hadn't already done it. Stay with me, guys. This next weekend, I'm going to be trying to upload some more content. In the meantime, guys, 
be cool and don't believe these whores when they say they're coming in at the airport or they're leaving at the airport, okay? And damn sure don't Western Union no money for an airline ticket because they can buy it cheaper. BS. Guys, be cool. Wrap it up. Flush it. Smash that like and subscribe button. You younger guys out there, save your money. Smash and dash as many hot girls as you can. Don't get married. If it flies, fucks, or floats, you need to rent it. Don't own it. Don't sign up for the total cost of ownership. Guys, sorry I've been working, but you guys know when all's up, I'm up. All's up. I've been working hard trying to add some real estate videos and another property later on. Till next time, guys, we'll see you down the road.